What's up, nerdlings? What's up, nerdlings? The nerd for your boy, Floyd. Hey, nerdlings. Cam Nelder here, and you're watching everybody's favorite couple on YouTube, Do You Nerd? That is right. It is video games monthly time. It is summertime. Let's get this thing naked, because that's what I want to do. Oh. Oh, it's bulgy. Ooh, there is a bit of a bulge. Kind of like on, me on. in the summertime, except it's here, not where it should be. Ooh, that's nice. What is Video Games Monthly? It is a monthly box that gets sent straight to your house after you have filled out your list of which video games you want from what system you want, and they ship them straight to you and you get to keep them. Hey, <laughs> that's perfect Ooh, for summertime. Ooh, we do love the coasters. Coasters, that you can never awesome. have too many coasters. Card saying, don't forget to populate your list. You're gonna like this one. Ooh, what up? Bring. Of course, I think the thing that you like more than that the bubble wrap! Be careful, don't scare the dragon. You want some bubble wrap? No. That's, that's funny because he's. Oh, here, you can have your own bubble he's wrap. He's got now. double. I'll pop it for you. Ahem. Thank you. You know what you can do in the summertime when the sidewalks get too hot? Stay inside. What can you break on them? An egg. Yeah, and, and how's a good way to cook eggs? On the oven. On the I, stove. I mean, scramble them, like hot oh, scramble. Hot scrambled eggs. How do you like your scrambled eggs? Lots of cheese. Like, I have a little bit of egg with my cheese. Well, that's a shame because it looks like you get giant space robots with this. Do they come with cheese? <laughs> so better luck next time. <laughs> That's not the only Famicom game we have. Oh. So. Well, I don't like this color. So is it a better color? Uh, it's it's like the yin and the yang because oh, boom. Oh, nice! Look, Look at that big at smiley this. cat on the front of that thing. Oh, he is so so happy. That, that's Paul. Oh, that's Paul. That's you think? Paul. Mm -hmm. So while it's not Paul, that is Doramon, and he is adorable. Wow! <laughs> you have got to stop stealing all my jokes. Come on, what, what am I even here We've for? We've been married for thirteen years, I think. <laughs> The bits are still eight and wonderful because we have a Sega Master System game. Oh. First of all, look at the glorious artwork on that this. That is amazing. <laughs> Fantasy Zone The Maze. So clearly what this is all about is taking your D&D group and leading them into a labyrinth of death. Are there half naked chicks in there and half naked men in there and they're all rolling dice around and stuff? That's what I think of D&D. &D. Is that is that wrong? Am I S wrong? Sign me up for uh, Fantasy Zone the Maze then. I think I've... I need to... I don't know what D&D &D is. <laughs> oh, getting the vapors. All right, the only uh, thing left in there are some box bits and then a GBA game, Pitfall, the Mayan Adventure. Hey, a uh, little pitfall hairy action. Nice. And you can take it on the go. So... We have a canteen that you can drink out of while playing that game. Uh, that's true. That's true. So, there you go. With the canteen, you can pop this into your GBA, and you can jump across crocodile heads while playing the game. And if you're quick enough, you can catch them, because alligator tail is amazing to eat. First of all, when are you eating alligator tail? And second of all, don't say that around him. He's going to hear that and That's freak true. out. But he's got a nice, like... Oh, just... <laughs> and just kidding, Dragon. It's okay. All right. Well, nerdlings, <laughs> a mostly 8-bit box of gaming goodness. A very good retro box. This yeah, yeah, definitely. I mean, with some Famicom goodness, you know, you've got Doramon here, put out by Hudson Soft. Generally, Hudson Soft was kind of a mark of quality whenever it came to old school games. And Bandai delivering with some robots not so much in disguise. I'm curious about this whole hot scramble thing. I don't think they will scramble the eggs the way I want. Uh, probably not. It'd probably be a <laughs> mess. Was it Pee Wee's Playhouse that had like the thing trying to scramble the eggs? Yeah, it, it was that whole working? like machine and it just made a mess. <laughs> it 
And then we also have Fantasy Zone, The Maze. Obviously, we always love to get some Sega Master System games into the collection because we just don't find them in the wild. No. And speaking of the wild, it doesn't get much more wild than Pitfall and the Mayan Adventure. I know I'm going to have a lot of fun with this one just because it's Pitfall. You'll have to play it with Dragon. Is that cool with you? <laughs> I'll just hand the thing to you because it's probably more your size anyway. I'll tell you what to do. He's got this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, Nerdlings, leave some comments down below on what you thought of any of these games. And I guess you are going to uh, prepare some Dragon Tail? No, not Dragon Tail. Alligator Tail. <laughs> There's more meat on those. <laughs> Don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok. And go over to the Retro Refresh website because it's pretty awesome over there. We've got some cool merchandise on the um, T Public, And if we like it, Nerdlings. We nerd it. Bye-bye. Sup, is it's the Nerdmeister. What? I'm channeling my stifler. Okay. The Nerdinator. The Nerdinator. <laughs> the Nerdinator. <laughs> Seeing what robots are up to even when they're not in disguise. How do you think robots scramble eggs? I got nothing. You got nothing? I think they probably just go. I don't know. What are robot scrambled eggs? I'm trying to think of like a robot joke. I don't know. <laughs>